Hello cousins. Welcome back to Chilling with Ali. 7 9 24 8 38 a.m. <laughs> Let's see what's going on. All right, so the first card out, you got Justice and the Magician. You made it happen, Captain. Better tell him again. This is what it is. You got some people that don't like you, but I promise they won't try you. Somebody says you're reckless. They hurt my feelings when they say I'm not involved. I just want to ball. But I can't because I'm not like them. I'm cut from a different cloth. Why, uh, uh, uh. Like, what the fuck you mean? I can't ball like y'all because I'm cut from a different cloth. But I don't want to ball like y'all. I don't want to be like y'all. Damn, I, w I used to wish I had them shoes like that other kid. But now I'm on, I could pay all of my brother's rents. They put their head up when they be talking to me. Yeah, respect me like a Don. I'm the president. Yeah, Justice and the Magician, you're the make it make it happen, Captain. You the make shit happen, Captain. I'm here in Young and May again. Eat. You out here doing it. Damn, I must really prefer these niggas. <laughs> The hatred, god damn. That just make you look less of a man, fam. And the shit on y'all was just part of the damn plan. And so you could be a feminine. There's a masculine that's feeling some type of... His bitch is really showing. Like, And I'm not talking about his girl. I'm talking the bitch in him is showing. <laughs> the hoe in him is showing. Like, I don't, I don't... You got a whole dude think that he beefing with a female. That's not happening. Some of y'all don't even know who this is. It's some random ass dude. This could also be somebody feels some type of way because you don't want them. You don't like them. They're not your type. You're not theirs. It's it's something real strange about that in itself. Um, meanwhile, they don't, understand, they don't understand the controversy made me hot. So why the fuck you think them haters going to make me stop? They forgot it was that Dr. Walker post that made me pop. I love this shit. This the shit that really made me guap. What you mean? I love this shit. This is shit that really made me guap. Yeah, Justice and the Magician, I feel like you getting on somebody's nerve. <clears throat> Yeah, because all I'm hearing is biker boys with Buddy was like, fuck you, smoke. The fuck are you talking about? Fuck you, smoke. That could be somebody's nickname. Ten of Wands, Two of Swords. Yeah, if that's the case, they're stalking you. Yeah, Ten of Wands and the Star. It's right there. It's it's all there. But the Magician and the Justice, whoever this karmic is, thought that they was going to come talk to you, come fuck with you. That's out. What's this? This is also somebody that basically said that if you're in uh, anything spirituality, especially tarot cards, you've lost your mind. You're crazy. You're this and you're that. Yeah, it's crazy. I make my head. I'm, what'd, he, what'd he say? I turn my haters to consumers. I make vets feel like they juniors. Everybody is feeling some type of way. Now, you don't got to be in a, um, like, you don't got to read or nothing. But if you in a tarot, somebody said that that shit was dumb. And I feel like actually you had quite a few people. It's weird that those same people are trying to use tarot to check up on you, though. Isn't that some interesting shit? What's this? Yeah, nobody can hide. I'm sorry. I see everything. I'm not sorry. Nobody can hide. All of these fucking energies, because the thing is, in order for you to be able to shine your light 100%, you got to see all the snakes in the grass. So all we do is turn up the brightness. Bitch, I see you, and bitch, you get cut up too. What's this? Nobody playing with you. Ain't no snakes in the garden. Show ass out. Because whoever this is, somebody is slithering towards you thinking that everything is fucking cool. Temperance, the sun, and the two of swords. Again, you had quite a few people that was like, this could be right now. This could be somebody right now that it's like, if you, <clears throat> let's say you and this person cool, y'all not cool. Whatever the case is, right? Whatever the case may be. You and the tarot. 
maybe you not in the tarot, but some of y'all be telling me all the time, like, I don't fuck with tarot, but I I watch you because your storylines is cold as fuck. Y'all say that shit all the time. I don't even I don't even fuck with tarot, but I do because because you because you be doing it. Yeah, that's because this really is tarot, but this ain't tarot. This is Ali Fod. With that being said, you got a lot of people that thought that they was going to play crazy with you. How the fuck you talking shit about me, but you still you sitting there stalking me? That doesn't make any sense. You didn't like what I was into. You didn't fuck with me. Now, all of a sudden, you all in? Yeah, all of these people, they all in. Why? Because you bring in justice with the magician. I told you I was lit. The fuck? I told you I was it. The fuck? Everybody's like, tag, not it. Don't worry. I got it. I'm tagging everybody. The fuck you mean? Five of wands, I'm tagging everybody. Don't even worry about that. I be it. I be it. I be it. Don't worry. What's this? Yeah. You got some people wondering, or you got somebody specifically that you do not fuck with at all. Like, ever. Temperance. This could be somebody from a long time ago. Yeah, they, they, they see what it is. Now somebody is fucking watching you. Could be a Sagittarius, but it definitely don't have to be. It could be a Cancer. It doesn't have to be. It could be a Libra. It doesn't have to be. It could definitely be a Taurus, though. Don't have to be, but I'm picking up that energy, too. It's somebody that wants to be grounded, but it seems like it's somebody that played crazy with you, too. Four of Wands, the Lovers, could be a Gemini as well. What's this? So a Swords could be an Air Sign. So Aqua could also be here. Isn't that funny? Didn't I just call you out, Aqua? Aquarius, here you are. You could be an Aquarius or this could be an Aquarius doing this. Nobody can. You don't have to be any of these signs and they don't have to be either. It's just funny that I called Aquarius and it's right here. But see, Aqua also rules I know. That's inner knowing. So you know the sun and the star. Yeah, two of swords. If you was wondering, is this person paying any money? Like, are they stalking me? Like, why, do I, why am I picking this person up in my energy? Are they talking about me? Are they this? Are they that? Absolutely. What's this? I'm just going to sit here quietly. Aries is out here. Five of Pentacles. You got a lot of people that are now in their feelings. Everybody misses you and shit. King of Swords, Five of Swords, Judgment. Somebody want to call you and just and just say they side of the story and make everything right. They want to talk. They want to they wanna work this out. You have justice and you are the fucking magician. That means as the magician, you bring in your own justice. How things are right now, if you're happy, that's how the fuck they supposed to be. Everything is balanced now. Oh, the balance feels right now. You and I, no more. We don't fuck with each other. So I'm good. You should be good too. What is the problem? Well, their problem is that they miss you. Your problem is that they miss you. And it's not even that that's the problem. The problem is that they're even in the fucking energy at all. Who is this? Well, I don't give a fuck. They ain't one of ours. You got multiple energies. But who are they? We don't give a fuck. They're not one of ours. If they was on our team, this wouldn't even be a thing, right? We wouldn't even be sitting here talking about this. This is the opposition because they're on the opposite side. Everybody wants to fuck you over and then later think that they're going to be best friends with you. Oh, we, you know, I had to grow up. Yeah, I'm glad you did. So now that the next person, they shouldn't have to deal with that problem, right? hey i was just the tutor i was just the one i just i just administered the test it's not my fault that you failed it i tried to help you i I tried to i tried to tutor you you failed it anyway how do you fail an open book test well because you choose to all these energies is weird that everybody is all in their feelings now but how the fuck are you in your feelings what are you sad for hold tell me get out of face and i got the fuck on why the hell is this bitch in her feelings why she still in her feelings why you still in this feelings Ain't these the same energies that played you, they ignored you? So you told me to get the fuck on, right? So I did. Why you still in your feelings? Now somebody is heavily in their feelings. These people are heavily in their feelings. Yeah, they slept on your ass before. They wide awake now. You know, when your child take a nap and they've been sleeping for a real long time, you like, yeah, they, when that motherfucker get up, they're going to be a problem. What's this? When they wake up, they're going to be a problem. I'm already knowing. Where the melatonin at? Yeah, you got the you got the Empress, the Ace of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Six of Pentacles. You got a whole lot of conversations being had about you in the background. Too bad that none of that's going down. Everybody loves to make plans for you in the background, but... You got divine intervention coming in. Why? Because whatever the fuck you say is going to happen. But I am whatever you say I am. If I wasn't, then why would I say I am? In the paper, the news, every day I am. I don't know. It's just the way I am. 
You're not engaging with no dumb shit. Point blank. Hey, you a squirrel today. Hey, I am whatever you say I am, G. Whatever you need to make you feel better. Just keep your fucking distance because you come anywhere near me. I'm going to shred your ass. That's just what it is. So, I'm trying to balance out my life. Ain't no room for holding grudges. But if you looking like you trying to pop, I'm with it, shorty. Fuck it. I'm not ducking nothing. I'm on all these bitches' heads. Burst, geese, goose, whatever. Back in front of those off their heads. Can't nobody touch me, son. Not talking about no melanin. I'm mad disrespectful. Fuck you and fuck your president. The fuck? What's this? King of Swords and the Five of Swords. Yeah, you got people feeling some type of way. Everybody's watching you, talking about you, talking whatever type of jazz and snazz about you. Everybody has... I'm telling you, everybody's literally talking about you. I feel like you know that. I feel like you have specific people that are talking about you. I feel like these are people that you've cut off. That could be family. That could be exes. That could be old friends. That could simply be energies. She was just like, I gave my attention to you for a second and you had me fucked up. So that's it. I'm good. You are a retired crash out. You don't you don't be with the dumb shit no more. You don't be with all this foolery, all this whacked out buffoonery no more. You don't be like that. Why? Because I done accomplished so much and I ain't trying to see it crumble. I be working so hard that I don't even see the hustle. That's just what it is. Ain't nobody giving energy to these people. Why would I give you energy and you fuck me over? Make that make sense. They only And in their mind, everybody loves to try to justify things. But the only way that they can justify this is if they justify it to themselves. They're going to have to say to themselves, well, I feel that um, things are not going well because I don't have what I want. That's actually what the fuck they would have to tell you. Like, they would have to be honest with themselves first. And to be honest, to, for these people to be honest with themselves is, is a, is a, that's an impossible task. That's mission impossible. And the reason why is because these people cannot acknowledge what the fuck they don't see as a problem. I don't fuck with you because you're a, you, you, you bottom line are a real, you're, you're a weirdo. You're a real life weirdo. Like you have a real problem. You're strange. That's how you feel about these energies. But again, it's categorical. You put these people all in a group. Like, y'all are not special. You're weird. They're weird. They're weird. They're weird. They're weird. This shit's weird. That's just what it is. It's just weird. It's just weird. It's just weird. Weirdotopia. You know what I mean? What's this? Weirdotopia, bro. Weirdotopia. Yeah, ten of swords. Now you got everybody. You're, see, you're in recovery with a lot of things, but everybody else is in ten of swords. Not everybody feeling like, oh, I just made a, I made a mistake and I shouldn't. Have. No, see, that's that's everybody favorite where I made a mistake. There ain't no motherfucking mistake. That was a choice. You made the choice the first time. A mistake is when you legitimately, accidentally do something. I did that by accident. Tell me that you did it on. Tell me that you did that. I did that on accident. Tell me that, and I'ma know that you did it on purpose. I did it on accident. No, you did things on purpose. That's always one of the... Oh, my dad used to drill that shit into my fucking mind. You did it on purpose. You did it by accident. If something was an accident, you did it by accident. If you did it on purpose, then you did it on purpose. You didn't do it on accident. You did it on purpose. I used to hear that shit all the time. It would be so annoying. Like, bro, chill out. It's not even that deep. It is that deep because you go and it's crazy because as much as they used to be grammar into my mind, as much as I read, as much as I used to have to read, do essays, all type of shit. I just felt like the other kids, they had to do that. My, my siblings, ain't had to do all that extra shit. But me, they was like, you ain't gonna be no motherfucking dummy. The fuck you a girl. You ain't gonna be so not that they stupid or nothing. They smart as fuck. But you, you, you ain't gonna be no motherfucking dummy. Hell no. I ain't saying that. I'm just saying, look at your brothers. <laughs> No shade, I'm just saying. Love all my brothers, but uh, they different. And I know they be saying the same thing. My little sister's different as fuck. For Professor X. This nigga called me Professor X and just casually walked off about his business. <laughs> like, oh, okay. All right. Y'all, I just woke up. It's still the morning time. I'm just, you know, casually chilling with y'all at, you know, 8.53. It's 8.53. What time I go to sleep last night? I shouldn't be awake. I should be asleep right now. What's going on? I'm just up tripping and shit. Okay, so.
all of a sudden you got multiple energies that's like all of a sudden they just they they having a clarity moment like they just get it now. oh my god i understand you understand what that you're a you the fuck nigga or a fuck bitch that's what you understand now what do you understand what are you talking about What 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 are you talking about? You understand? What do you understand? What are you talking about? These energies, I kid you not, feminines, mas, because there's the queen of cups. I'm not playing feminines, masculines. It doesn't matter. These energies from your past are sitting there. Like, I just really miss you. I just feel like everything. <laughs> Shit, that don't nobody understand. I know what you crying for. I could tell you what you ain't gonna get though. <laughs> Fuck. Whoever this is wants to know after all of this time, can y'all just be cool? They want to come around and do right now. But why you ain't do right the first time? I'm not giving nobody hope because this for damn sure is not going to happen. I'm just asking why they didn't do right the first time. Five of wands. Why you was a demon the first time around? When your first child is an angel, but the second one, oh, that one is different. There's multiple energies that stabbed you in the back. Put 10 swords in your back, bro. These are multiple energies that did you dirty as hell. Everybody has guilty consciences or that's starting to brew up. It's like it's like the universe is sending them fucking vibrations right up, bro. You know how like uh what what are we called um fuck what's the name of it? Um it's not magnetic being. What is the name? There's an actual name. When you stand, okay, I, it's I, I I can't think of the name right now. I can't think of the name right now. But when you stand barefoot in the grass and you let the sun, so it's it's a cycle. You let the so you're standing there, right? The sun is beaming down. It's coming in from the top, going all the way down. It's like a filter. It's filtering out, you know, it's bringing you down lows, good light, good energy. It's draining out. So when you're standing with your feet in the grass, in the universe, like you're connecting with the universe. You're as as the good light's coming in. It's like it's pushing all of the negative. It's draining the negative energy back into the universe. It's cycling back out, so you get the good energy as you're draining out. It's like, it's like, um, it's like spiritual, uh, I don't know. It's like a blood cleanse. It's a spiritual blood cleanse. I don't know how to put that shit. It's you, you clean out your whole system using the sun. I feel like you mad connected, but you should, you should definitely go out and cut some of y'all. Like, I ain't put my feet in the grass, whatever. Just stand in the grass. Just connect with the universe. Hug a tree. I used to think my sister was weird as fuck for doing that. I still do. She got my niece hugging trees and shit. I get it. I just, that's just not something I do. So, you know, it's weird to me. I mean, it's a thing. It's just, you know, something I'm still trying to get used to. It's a very powerful tool, though. That's connecting with the fucking universe. It's connecting with nature. Everybody get clarity from, you know, different ways. Three of Cups. Yeah, Ten of Swords, Five of Wands, Three of Cups, and a Star. Yeah, you know who these energies are. Yeah, Four of Swords, Ten of Cups. Could be, like I said, family, friends, exes, people that you just cut off, just bottom line. They miss you because Ten of Swords is there. These are, you don't have a guilty conscience, but they do. So that speaks volumes. You're not thinking about any of them, but they're thinking about you. That speaks volumes. Some of y'all, this is one person. Some of y'all, these are multiple people. Again, some of y'all, you don't connect with your family. This could simply be your family. What's this? Yeah, you're being watched. The Hermit and the Queen of Pentacles. Um, it could be a feminine watching you or uh, 
feminine you're being watched knight of cups yeah it's it's some energies that feel like they were childish um i didn't i didn't see what it was but again this is categorical because isn't everybody in the same reading they're all in the same boat bro nobody no one person in these in this entire reading there's like five energies here four or five energies no one person in these reads did anything different from anybody else because in the end of it the outcome was still the same they're all in the same read in the same position feeling the same exact way why well because you brought justice to yourself and you're the magician so basically i told you i was lit you told me that i must be crazy okay so you went on about your business so really what it is is it only seems to me like they only miss you and shit because if life is great now theirs is still running exactly how it was before i made a change you stayed the same i got ahead of you that's what it seems like to me like it really don't seem like it's too much going on it just simply seems like you made a change you changed life and life is better for you and these people are in the same position if not worse missing you now because they feel like you make things better so they watch you as a as a feel good type of thing so if you just let's say you just here and there you just post pictures or something you on snapchat post a picture post it on facebook post it like you just posting on your social medias real quick and it seems like there's somebody on each platform that's that's just like stalking it's like you can almost pick up the energy too like i know such and such on this one watch i know such and such on this one i know such and such on that it, it, it just seems like like that type of energy but bottom line is you're not thinking about any of these energies but if you pick them up it's just like you're aware of it it's like it's just like oh the lighter's over there okay what do we all know for a fact right now the lighter's right there other than that it's just a part of the room like it's just the object in the room everything else is in the room too like it's like 10 deck of cards 10 decks of cards on the table as well like with just something in the room you know what i'm saying it's just another object in the room so it just seems like you're not paying these energies any mind again they're not special this is so something about this seems pretty weird though because i'm not sure how to word it but what it seems like, i'm gonna just give a quick description of what i'm seeing though more visually than right here in the cars it's just weird because it seems like <clears throat> you got energies waiting on you to call it a number tell the story about me because i keep hearing story time tell the story about me tell the story about me you know how everybody be like yeah i got a story about that part like you deal with somebody y'all don't work out so of course there's a story there's a beginning a middle and an end like there's a story now you got energies kind of sick or maybe they're fucking paranoid that you're gonna call a number next because pull pulling people's cards is so cathartic so that's what i'm wondering like so you might be a reader i don't know but i know all of a sudden everybody seems to be in a spirituality or into some shit because of you something maybe you do tarot because a lot of y'all that watch me are tarot readers so you could definitely be a reader but if you are and you tell stories like if you tell stories like you put your stories in like i do yeah somebody's scared that you're gonna call their number next and then what they gonna do come in your come in your comments and argue with you all right because you talk about me because you talk about when me and you was together you think they're gonna ask they self out like that you might have some dummies willing to do it but i don't think that they're prepared for what comes after that so do you think that they're really going to ask themselves out like that because i don't that's why they're sitting there quietly also trying to figure out can me and you just be cool somebody doesn't want something to come out you must have access to some type of knowledge that can come out and they really hoping that you don't because i'm get i'm gonna assume the reason really why is if you figure out whatever this is about them and expose it that means that the chances of you fucking with them completely is out like you're not you're completely done in their mind they're still about five percent holding on to the fact that me and you could still work this out like it's it's a major comeback that could happen it's a major comeback i think this lifeline is the fuck over it's 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 out this person is poisonous they're completely fucking poisonous point blank and period 
they don't know what to do about that but they just hoping knight of cups they just hoping that they can come in and charm you six i told you this is my social media card six of wands my social media card this person they're they, these people are watching you not one of them is special they all did the same thing but everybody's sitting there or somebody specifically is sitting there thinking that they still no these energies still want you But if you find out that I'm a dog, you ain't gonna wanna fuck with me. Nah, if you a dog, I'm a dog too. That's all that means. What's this? I know. I hear you stomach. Calm down. What's this? I know you hungry. Shit. I'm hungry too. <laughs> Nine of Pentacles, the Wheel of Fortune, the Six of Pentacles, Three of Wands, Knight of Cups. Yeah, you got quite a few people watching you. I told you there's multiple energies. Three of Wands. They may be quiet, but again, they trying to kind of figure out like first of all one thing about these people is you know for a fact they good for stalking they good at this stalking shit if they not talking they what exactly if they ain't talking they stalking that therefore you knew that they was stalking when y'all broke up you knew that they was trying to get your attention when y'all broke maybe y'all you ain't had you on social media but they knew where you lived at they knew where you be at they knew where you worked at these people are back at it they just trying to casually slide through again because you have justice and you are the magician the way that you done made shit happen is kind of hard not to sit there and try to analyze you y'all thought i'd be just sitting there bugging yeah these people they be full on watching they don't know how it happened what to do what to say they don't know it's just like how the fuck how you get so fly how you did that sugar sugar how you get so fly why is you talking to me that's that's like masculine or feminine is like it's like why is you talking to me that's how you feel about these energies whether you are masculine or feminine these these people from the past or it's these people that tried to play you in school or 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 like back in the day or something i'm really getting a schoolhouse like like maybe you had a crush on somebody or some people or maybe you thought some people was cool or maybe they used to play crazy with you in school i don't know what the fuck but all of a sudden yeah i guess i played my numbers real good check the mathematics so did somebody used to bully you or something or was you outcasted or I don't know what to call this like because it's a shock that you you really see here's the thing see some people are happy it's like oh yeah that's such and such that's such and such we went to school together I feel like you got a lot of people saying that shit like if y'all are not really connected to the people that you so, like, I'm back on social media, right? This is just an example. I'm, I finally got back on social media after, like, five, six, seven years. Somewhere around there. I think it was, like, six, seven years. Somewhere around there. Finally get back on social media. And the first time when I had the travel business, when I was doing that, Damn, I really done did everything. When I had the tra when uh I was doing my travel business, I had I was adding a lot of people that I used to know because it was like okay, well shit, that make it easier. Then I was sitting there thinking about it. I was like, that's the that's always the the cardinal sin. It's always adding people that you know. Then be the people that just really be trying to play crazy with you, but the people that don't know you actually look into you. They pay attention. So they can determine that. But the people that already know you, sometimes that's why y'all be like, well, well, my my family and them don't support the people around me. You be expecting them to support. But the thing is, they know the old you. This new you, they ain't trying to fuck with you. They, they don't believe people change. They don't they don't believe in this new you. They won't believe in this new you until everybody else does. Unfortunately, that's just how it works. That's that's really literally just the way it goes. Like, I, I couldn't make it up. Everybody is supporting, and then they stop supporting, and then everybody else, the whole world will fuck with you. Then everybody else will start fucking with you, too. Yeah, you... I don't know. I feel like you doing your thing, and all of a sudden, maybe you go viral or something. Like, you doing good. You doing numbers. Like, you doing your thing, and all of a sudden, you you got a lot of love and support. People like, oh, yeah, I know that person. Me and such and such went to school. Hey, ain't that, uh... You know how people, when they watching a movie, and they can't remember who the actor... Ain't that, uh... That's, uh... That's, uh... Hold on. Yeah, that's... People doing that shit to you now. You're being talked about because your follower increase, your visual increase is all going up nine of pentacles whatever you're doing it is working so all of a sudden you you gonna have some people from your old schoolhouse days like yo whether that be middle school elementary school high school college trade school people gonna be like oh that's such and such we went to school together you gonna start popping up in algorithms or something if you're online 
I don't know how it happens, but that's that's going to happen. Like people, you are not a forgettable individual. Believe it or not, some of y'all be like, I just be keeping to myself. I'm just, a, but you're not forgettable. Something about you is your energy, is your face, is you, is your you your walk, is your demeanor. It's something about you that's just not forgettable. That's just what it is. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> 